Hello, welcome back to Tips and Time Savers. I'm Danny Rocks. I love keyboard shortcuts. I use them every day. There are some keyboard shortcuts that I use more frequently than others. However, the one that I use every day, my all-time favorite keyboard shortcut, is the keyboard combination Control plus Z to undo my last action. Control Z has saved me from near disaster on more than one occasion, such as the time that I accidentally deleted a complex formula that I had been working on for the past 15 minutes. Control Z undid that deletion and it also saved me from a panic attack. Control Z is like having a guardian angel on my shoulder as I work inside Excel. Let me illustrate Control Z. Here I've selected three cells. I want to average January, February, and March, but unfortunately I click the auto sum icon by mistake. So instead of averaging the cells, I now have a sum. I'll use Control Z to clear my auto sum come back and choose the drop down options next to auto sum and say average now if i wanted to apply some formatting such as apply currency take away the decimal points put in a different foreground color uh, increase the font and say you know i think that's a little too much i can use control z one action at a time is removed or if I want to go and remove multiple actions, I can remove my last 16 actions, either Control Z 16 times, or come up on the standard toolbar and see the undo icon and click the drop down next to it to go back and undo all of my actions up to the last 16. For everything that I undo, there is the companion keyboard shortcut control Y to restore the actions that I just undid. So here I can go back and restore to the point that I want, remove selectively, or remove multiple actions. It's your choice. Now, Control Z, Control Y are so popular that in Excel 2007, we now can undo up to our last 100 actions or restore up to our last 100 actions. And the command buttons for undo and redo are two of the three commands that are installed by default on the quick access toolbar. So over here I can go back in Excel 2007 and re undo all of my actions or put them back in place. It's your choice. I think that you'll have fun experimenting with the Control Z, Control Y keyboard shortcuts and I'll see you in the next lesson.